Oh, that is, that makes me so happy. Hello everybody and welcome to episode 6 of Owls TV. Um, we've got some exciting news this week. We have our Owls pen. Finally, we have some in production. I know you've all been waiting for a very long time. We've got a few more updates today about our gummies, new uh, products that are going to be going into production this week. And you know what to do at this point because you're going to like and subscribe so you can be kept up to date and make sure every time an Owls video comes out that you're going to see that message pop up. And if that's not even good enough, we're going to be doing a giveaway every week when the Owls video comes out on YouTube. What we'll do is, is the very first commenter will get one Owls full mill. And then we will do a random selection for the other people that comment and your name will go into a draw or your username and you can get the second owl cartridge. So just remember that, like and subscribe and that way you have an opportunity every week to grab one of these bad boys. So let's talk a little bit about, uh, about this week, how it's gone. As you can see, I'm pretty happy. Uh, we finally started production. We got some, we got some Northern Lights done, some train wreck, some mimosa, and some pineapple. And um, what we'd love to know as well, and please leave these in the comments below. As we get through this batch, we want to know what other flavors are there that you want to see. The more that you can let us know about what you would like, or some big hitting strains that you haven't been able to get a hand on, please let us know. We'll do our best to implement them and um, please just drop a comment below about that. Um, when we want to talk a little bit about the gummies, so we have a good amount of feedback on the gummies. If you are a regular marijuana user, a 50 milligram Delta 8 gummy is going to hit you pretty nicely, not too strong. However, we did, you will be very relaxed, you'll have a clear head. Some people were actually using 100 milligrams of the Delta 8. However, we did also have some people who ate 25 milligrams or ate the full 50 who don't use marijuana on a regular basis who felt that it was a little bit on the strong side. So just make sure that you are um, taking note yourself of your own tolerance. Low and slow is always the best way to go. And, um, and it's always good to wait. So if you're, if you're wondering to yourself, hey, is a 50 milligram gummy gonna be too much for me? Hey, I haven't tried Delta 8. How is that gonna make me feel? Eat a half, eat a quarter, wait an hour, see how you are, and then progress further into eating more of them. Um, but it's just important, we wanna make sure that no one's taking too much because they didn't realize, so it's just important that you are, you are doing your due diligence yourself. Um, so we have, some, we have another product that's gonna be going into production this week, and I'm not gonna say anything else more than that because I feel like I'm always telling you everything that's happening and I want to hold a little bit back. Um, and so the gummy packaging right now is being finalized. It's probably going to be another like four weeks to five weeks though until that actually lands here. But gummies are going into production right now. The owls carts are here. They're ready. These are just the best. I, I don't care what anybody says. These are the best carts that you're ever going to have. I mean, the quartz coil is better than the ceramic. There's no question about it. Look at the, I can't wait. We're gonna do a show and tell after this because it's pretty hard on the camera for you to see it. But this oil here is like so crystal clear. The effect, the effect is, is so pleasant. Just look at this. This is on a low volt and look at this. Oh, that is, that makes me so happy. I'm sure it'll make all of you so happy, but we have worked long and hard for this. I can promise you this is absolutely quality. This is a fire cartridge, and I just can't wait to get them out there. Just this low temp, people. This low temp is just something special, and the flavors on these is better than any other cart that you can get. So we'll do a little bit more of a show and tell. I wanna talk a little bit more about the terpenes uh, once, we, once we cut from this and uh, just talking about these carts. And we also, look, we got the flavor on them. Hardly anybody has the flavor on them. When you've got all your carts and you go, oh, which one is it? You know it else. 
because we put the flavor on there, etched on there, not just like a little sticker put on there. So just better quality than I think the many others can offer. It's not some cheap car, that's for sure. So in other news, can you believe this? But there is eight states where marijuana is still legal. Eight states. No medicinal, no recreational. It is illegal. Don't go near that devil's lettuce, folks. So I'm delighted to tell you that Delta 8 is something that we'll be able to be shipping. It is something that is legal and we will have a website. So if you, we will be able to tell you when you log on to our website, whether it's legal for us to ship you Delta 8 or not. But um, I can promise you we'll be doing our best to service everybody. Now that we finally have our packaging almost completed for the owls uh, carts, we just need to pull the trigger. We got the last samples. We put them up on the Instagram, had good feedback there, but we will hopefully have those starting to be ordered this week, have them next week starting to be packaged. Once I have them in hand, we'll start building the websites. So I'm going to make sure that hopefully in the next two to three weeks that we'll have some good updates for all of you on the website. And um, overall, I just want to thank you. I want to thank you all. It's this cannabis prohibition has been so long. We've all been waiting so long for just like a break to be able to just buy whatever we want, have it mailed, you know, have our free, have a good selection from different states, different dispensaries. There's still so much, so much like just getting through the weeds with cannabis and just know we've been going through the same thing as every single one of you. We want legalization, full legalization. We want to make sure that everyone has the right access to medicine, not some black market junk. And so just want to thank you for all the support that each of you have been giving us. We're going to go to our, uh, our nice show and tell. We'll show you some of our cannabis terps, our plant derived terps, a few of our different owls that we've made so far. predominantly down to the terpenes and also down to, uh, to, the, to the heat. Uh, this is starting to go a little bit more golden. It will begin to oxidize and the color will change a little bit. Um, so I wanted to just show you some of the terpenes that we have to give you some perspective. Uh, here's some of our uh, plant-derived botanical terpenes. Uh, as you can see, it's, uh, the color is pretty clear. It's almost got a yellow hint to it. Um, then we have another one here, this mimosa. Very, very clear botanical terpenes. I wish you were able to smell these. They just smell wonderful. And then we come over here to our, uh, our cannabis derived terpenes. Um, these have been extracted by CO2 and, um, and this is from the marijuana plant. The differences between the botanical terpenes and the marijuana terpenes is that we as humans can never really mimic exactly what a plant does to 100% efficiency. We could say, hey, there's some different types of uh, terpenes in this one, and we could maybe say there's 1% of, uh, of pinene, there's 0.5% of beta carophylline, and just go down the list, go to some mercy, but you'll never be able to get that same, like for instance, in this occasion here, we got a very limited amount of sour diesel. And I mean, this stuff is just straight gas. It's so, Oh my God, I'll never get old a lot. And so, there's, again, this is, there's, it takes a lot to get this little jar. We're only able, we're only gonna be able to do a thousand of the sour diesel carts and then that's gone. So, with our platinum owls and our cannabis derived terpenes, because they are far harder to come by, um, it's really get them before they're gone. So, um, yeah, we just wanted to show you, as you can see from the amnesia cookies here. Um, again, it just smells great. It is, uh, it is a little bit more on the clarity side. It's just, it's just the way the extraction happened. But again, oh my God, it feels like you're in like a fresh bakery or something like that. Our Delta 8, as you can see the color, and especially for such 
a large volume of oil. You can see how crystal clear this is. Okay, so you can see just how thick this oil is, right? It is very sticky. It is especially in such large buckets like this. But you can see that oil isn't even coming together. So just think of how much work has to go in to even remove it from here, get it into a jar, get everything weighed up, mix it with terpenes, put it in an oil syringe, get it in a cartridge. There is a lot, a lot of work that goes into this and that's why we want you to see all of this. We're trying to give you a little bit more of a behind the scenes so you can really see what happens when you are actually making a cartridge. So yeah, anyway folks, I look forward to when we will be able to actually meet in person when trade shows are back online. Um, make sure to take care of yourself during this coronavirus. We certainly are. We're delighted to be able to put the head down and get these products to you. Hope you're having a good Friday. Like and subscribe. Make sure to drop a comment below for that free cartridge every week. Let's go.